Yo guys, what's up? Marcel Kiefer here and I'm driver for Repo Racing Esports and today I've got another world record track guide and setup guide video for you and driving on the Silverstone or Keystone circuit. Let's get into it. Come on guys, do I even have to say it? Get a good exit out of the final corner, short shift into fifth to get maximum traction. Um, early on the power, then don't get an off track at the beginning because it will invalidate your lap for the next lap. Now turn one is flat, clip it on the inside, don't cut it um, like too much because then you will get an off track. Here brake right before the curb starts on the left, down to fourth gear, you brake until the cur uh, until the curb to the apex, then you release the brakes, a bit of throttle, brake again, not fully, down to third gear, short shift into fourth for the exit, really important, at least for me. Then be careful on the exit curb, as you could see, um, I made a mistake there, you shouldn't do it, it costs you a lot of lap time. There was still like half a tenth in there. Um, now you brake at around the 50 meter board or, uh, board or right before that. Heavy braking, then quickly release the brakes and trail brake into the corner, fifth gear. Now Lafield is kind of just a little dab on the brake, then down to third, um, upshift into fifth for short shift, then use all the track and cut here on the inside to minimize track distance. Next corner's corpse and completely flat, just a little bit of steering input. At the beginning it might be tricky, but over time you will get used to it. And now the S section is really important. You cut here on the inside. Now you just lift a tiny bit down into 7th gear. And now you brake down to 6th or 5th if you want and accelerate already. But you have to use the inside curb to line up the car for the exit. And yeah, it's, it's really hard to master, but it feels good if you, if you nail it. And now first corner of sector 3. Stow, you brake right at the curb between the curb start and the 50 meter bot. Now you go to the inside, accelerate early out of it in sixth gear and here you brake after the 100 meter bot, right before the white line, down to third until the apex you brake, then short shift into fourth, short shift into fifth and you brake a tiny bit if you mess up the line like I did and then early on the power and that's your lap. And now I will show you the lap without any commentary. And now you can see we have the world record again. Xay is definitely a cheater or glitcher, even though the time is close. Um, I've seen his ghost and his lap time or splits, and it wasn't legit. Uh, the setup, I would run a bit more rear wing. The transmission off throttle, I would probably lower it a tiny bit, but it's all right. And the suspension definitely soften it for the race. It is a super, super instable setup, so be careful with that. Apart from that, it's decent, so try it out and let me know how you like it. If you have any further questions, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any further questions, then just check out my Twitch channel in the description below and ask me questions there. Uh, if you have any, or in the comment section, but on Twitch it's easier because I can immediately reply to you if I see your question. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, bye bye.